Nós vamos pôr o house. De Leones. Get, uh, get full. Uh, good morning, Kako. How are you doing? Uh, uh, hey, hey, boy. Hit the road. Hit the road. Uh, turn down the... Uh, what do you call the one that... Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I wanna... And then uh, turn down the high and bring up a little bit bass. Uh, give you guys uh, a short order on uh, the on the makahiki. Alert! 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 Ricky Torres. Okay, I, wa I wanna give you guys a uh, 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 what do you call that uh, a symposium on uh, the makahiki. Uh, not too long ago, but in the past, with the uh, Protecta Ho'olawe Ohana um, and uh, Edith Kanakaole uh, Foundation. Yes? So what are you calling me? Um, uh, we started uh, the Makahiki in Kaho'olawe, but on this island, the first one was uh, Palikapu, Deadman, Kau. And then uh, in, our, in those days, um, what do you call... Uh, uh, the, the native people was uh, uh, what we call willy willy ma maloko kapakini. We was in a pakini going in circles, but as long as we was going forward, we thought we had direction. But the circle was we was getting really competent at going in circles, and uh, so. But what we felt at that time was we lacked the moral compass, you know, uh, to be uh, lost correctly. We was lost incorrectly. So um, uh, I, I guess we, we, we recognize that not having a nuclear bomb uh, made it kind of uh, hard for us to take up cool, cool and go scrap with the uh, Navy SEALs. So we took up Lono um, to uh, what they call Lono is the god. Uh, Lono actually uh, is a good friend of all of Wahine. Because every time we get war, the men's all market. So uh, the population, hard for reproduce, because the, 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 the staff of life did. But the, the, the punani still it flourishing, you know. So my grandfather said, when you, when you get old, your balls catch cold and the tip of your dick come blue. <laughs> it because if you don't, if you don't combo, the, the bugger lose fertilizer. So the wahine, the Wahine uh, recognizing that uh, 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 the, the males was, uh, was dying, they would make one union, they made one union, and they would not uh, ask Akualono at the time of Makahiki for stop all wars, because that way you could repopulate for the next wars, you know? Because it, it, it seemed like stocks and bonds. If you don't put nothing in the bank, you're going to bankrupt. So, uh, that was uh, uh, how we was looking at it back in the PKO days with Brother Earl here, Brother Ricky. Uh, um, uh, that uh, it was uh, more uh, better for us to uh, embrace uh, Akualono. In the, cause at that time, there was bombing Kaholave. So um, we, uh, we, we, we asked the, uh, the Kanakaoles uh, for help us to... Um, what they call create the ceremonies and uh, the, the proper uh, procedure and the protocols. And uh, at the, in them days now, you see nowadays, in the old day, had two, two uh, heao, uh, heao kane, heao wahine. And then uh, the, us guys was the mo'olonos, we was the bro mo's, and the wahines was the bra ma's. You know, so that uh, uh, the Wahine give their whole couple to the Wahine Heao, and the men's give the whole couple to the men's Heao. And then uh, what, what, what we uh, learned uh, in them days was the, the, the tutors was thinking, we can go any Heao we like. 
So uh, we, we ran into a little bit of uh, conflict with uh, the integration of um, the nuclear bomb and uh, 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 pounding copper. You know, that they, they had a, 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 what they call, conflict. There was a conflict. You know, so uh, uh, the first couple times, we never let the Wahine on. But what would happen? The Wahines went when we left. So the way we was thinking about it then, you know, if you hold too strict to the couple, we're going to crack. So if you, if you see now that the, um, the ceremonies, when we first started, uh, Palakapu started them in Kau. He was the first one. Then uh, we made Hilo, and then Brother Earl made uh, Kona. So, uh, uh, you know, we did them as, as um, uh, what do they call cultural as possible. You know, we made the emu, and then throw net, go dive pork fish for the awe awe. But the, as time move on, the, 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 the type of people we work with was not, uh, what you call, uh, kahakaula. You guys know where it's kahakaula? As, uh, as all the guys talk Hawaiian language up there on the hill, they're different from us. We're the, we're the welfare warriors. Those guys, are, uh, how, how I say, uh, they, they know it's in the air. So, but what when uh, occur in the reality of life and the, and the beauty of culture, we had to mix the two. And the reality was, uh, we was overwhelmed with alcoholics and druggies. And uh, if you stay, if you sleep here tonight, might not be too bad because we're in the middle of the month. But if you like to see the vampires, you come here during the first week. When the welfare check come in, this place over here is buzzing. You know, all these guys coming in, buying drugs, guys going to sell it. Boom, 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 boom. The first week, this is on city because it's the end of the road. But that's why uh, our, our uh, branch of uh, Lono, is not very relative to uh, the, the, the pretty Kanekas. We work with the ugly Kanekas. And uh, you, you, you might not see them, but uh, they're going to come because this is their hangout. Because the police don't come in here. We're no more police going to get gray. So we brought Lono. First time we brought Lono, we brought him to uh, Onekaka. We'd run right there, the fugitive Yoshi. Um, what do you call uh we had three, one, two, four homeless village. This was a big village. Hana village two over here, Buchikaile, our village, Onekaka village, and uh, Breakwall village. So we've been trying to organize all other villages to create a, 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 a political emphasis on. Oh uh, yeah, look at my shirt. You guys can see my shirt. Ah, uh, too far. Anyway. The, the point being that uh, we, we were trying to create a, a, a political middle finger with all the uh, ugly Hawaiians. But uh, poverty is not only for Kanakas. We had Portuguese, Samoans, Japanese, Puerto Rican, uh, Filipino. We were like on real plantation. So when we started our makahiki, we started them in Onekaka. And that at that time was on a pretty big uh, homeless village. I mean, houseless for the Kanakas. So, I think we had, uh, the people, for little whiles, they got uh, excited, you know, and then the, they wanted to learn their language. Aloha, ahui ho, bambai, see you later. And uh, to a certain degree, um, uh, what do you call them? I think that uh, we was trying to remove the depression from oppression. And for uh, uh, here and there, I think we had some success. But, here's the but. Now that um, uh, I old and my ball's catching cold, we pass them on to uh, my daughters. There's all my daughters doing all this and my nieces, even in the village. Because, uh, I don't know, man, because, you know, you, we, we had to uh, accommodate ourselves, like I was saying earlier to be efficient at going in on circle. Because you'll be frustrated if you go in a circle and you don't accomplish anything. That's a joke. Anyway, uh, so uh, <laughs> I got ahead of myself. So what we was trying to uh, 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 create was uh, like this is a, a stop in the circle. 
You know, because if the circle willy willy, willy willy, willy willy, it's same like when you drive. You're not supposed to look at the line on the road because the bugger go hypnotize you. And then you don't pay attention to your forward progressive movement. So we felt that this makahiki would put a cease and desist to going in on circle. Boom! You got to stop right now and analyze how with the blinker stuck, we, we, we still going in a circle. What can we, uh, uh, what they call, uh, figure out to have some, uh, what they call, uh, po um, progress in going in a circle. And we felt that uh, the Lono, uh, uh, so in the old days, everybody supposed to go heel away, you know, go in the water. But you know, go in the water when you get sunlight. The every, you know, even the fish, they all change when the sun touches the ocean. When, when he dark and the bugger get the gray line on top, that's the best time for children net. Because the fish is half heaven, half earth. So before these kind of things, we all supposed to go in the water naked. Drop your laundry naked. And then commune with silence. Silence is the language of the gods. Eh? That's right, boy. So we figure all that out, but... Uh, Inadvertently, oppression is such a humongous monolith that uh, you got to be like the mosquito in the tidal wave. You know, stick finger above the tidal wave. No go down to the bottom and call them all kind of names. So we, we were thinking um, that uh, this makahiki would present us uh, a, a, a time to reflect on the past year and uh, see how we're going to adjust and hopefully move forward. But I got to be honest, okay? I'm not going to see the uh, jerk your chain. Ah, boy. The circle is the same, you know? For us guys used to only drink beer, I recognize now that uh, we used to be drunk so much that we was in desperation to, uh, to feel better about uh, being stuck. You know, if you're stuck with 50 people, you don't feel as bad. So I recognize that now, as uh, the educated Kanaka, is just smarter at being stuck. But I, I don't see um, uh, Hawaiian language. I went over and over and over. I only could go so far, because I only went ninth grade. So I only went third year, pow, the bugger after that, the bugger talking French. So, uh, I mean, now, what? else we get for do sense of make believe because what we believe um, if Jesus can walk on the water well we can too the only thing I, the Christian used to get mad at me what I object to Jesus walking on the water why he not take on net? you know if he can walk on the water I would walk behind the wave and throw because the fish they look inside so but anyway we, we was thinking that um we can bring the Lono in and uh, procreate because uh, little by little, a lot of our trouble is within ourselves. And uh, until you fix yourself, I don't think we can fix somebody else. You know, and um, we've been trying age old uh, philosophies of put the Hawaiian back on the land. But like I was saying earlier, he just would move stupid from where he was to into the village. So here we are, stuck with stupid, till death do us part. So kako, haole makaiko, and hopefully the great God Lono uh, can uh, uh, resurrect within us a sense of dignity. And uh, 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 but more than in, not only the dignity, but the sense to recognize reality. You know, reality is a kick in the ass, but that's life. Make believe. You refuse to get, you know, there's only two type of people in the world. One provide the boot and one provide the ass. So, if you're no more boot, you get a kick in the ass. 
So uh, I want to close my, uh, and all he's got to do with the God Lono now. And then that's why we, uh, we resurrected the God with hopefully that there be a sense of reality within this uh, uh, annexation of make-believe. You know, you know, because I was with the kingdom guys. I was with uh, Shah. No, no, no. You know what? Shah never liked us because we was ugly. I was with CNHA, but they've been bullshit me. They only wanted color. So uh, our troubles is uh, it's still there. And hopefully the Lono Makaiki can give us a respite and uh, redirection to Holomua. Because uh, we have to Holomua. And uh, I wish all you guys a, a happy Makahiki and uh, good life. And uh, you got to get it up to get it in. Goodbye.